What's going on, guys? Today we have the mini tins for Crown Zenith. I found them. Uh, they got them in at my local Walmart, so I grabbed one of each artwork. Each one has two packs and a different, uh, like a different card in the back. That, uh, like a, it's like a collectible card, or just like a special card that they make for these tins, and. Uh, they all go together to make a scene, so I don't know if I can get this open here or not. I'm going to try to get this open quick for the intro so I can show you guys. There we go. So if you put the five, just get that off. you put the five cards together, they'll make the picture like so, which we will do at the end just to show you what they look like. But uh, for now, let me get, while you guys are watching the intro quick i'm gonna get these unwrapped and get them ready to open for you guys and let's see what we find All right, I am back. Like I said, I got one of each artwork so we can complete the uh, the set. We have a Charizard there and more Peko. So let me know which tin you think is going to do the best. We'll open them up here in a way that uh, we'll open them up here in a way that we keep them together. I just set the one off to the side so that. Uh, I have the picture so they get set up right. But as you can see on the back, they have some information about the card on the front. This is Charizard. And there's that. And in these, they actually even included a sticker. You get stickers with them too, so that's kind of cool. I don't remember that being a thing in the older mini tins, but it could be something they're starting or it could be something that they did uh, or that they're just doing for Crown Zenith. You never know. So we'll get those with that one. Then we have uh, Wulu, which goes next to Charizard, so we'll put him there, just like so. Then we have the Wulu sticker. Whoop, I didn't show you guys. <laughs> there you go, Wulu sticker, very nice. And we have the two packs for Wulu, so there's those. And then we have uh, Yamper. There's your Yamper card. Goes over here next to Charizard and, and uh, the sticker. Very nice. And his two packs. And we have Hatina. Hatina goes on this side. Like so. There we go. And the sticker for him. And his two packs. And then... Last but not least, we have more Peko. Goes on this side. His sticker. And his two packs. Very nice. All right. So, oh, you know what? It looks like they might be doing these. used to come with a coin in them. So, or I think they came with a coin in them. So, they might be doing the stickers in place of the coin, which, honestly, for me, that's kind of cool because I'd much rather have a sticker than a coin, only because all the coins get so that they look the same but uh we're gonna start right in with these we're gonna start with more peco see what he gets there's your code card you guys know you get all the code cards in these everything we open uh, i've been opening some stuff off camera so that i could get my own code cards for the tcg online and uh that way, if any of you guys want to... Oh, we're starting right off with it. Ditto. Very nice. Um, and if any of you guys want to want to play the TCG online, just let me know. Uh, I have a previous video with my my username for that, or just leave, leave a comment saying you want to know, and I will put the username down below. So, I'm going to get into pack number two for more Peko see what he's gonna have like i said if you haven't yet let me know which tin you think is gonna do the best 
Reverse Waylord and a Kyogre. Very nice. All right. So more Pecos doing pretty good here with the Kyogre V. Very nice. Put those guys there. Then we'll get into uh, Wulu. Uh, and your code card for him. Let's see what Wulu gets. We're going to have Gloom and Sal Saladin and Coughing. Badoof. Sunkern. Mr. Mime. Yon Mega. And a Stoutland V. All right. It's doing pretty good. Still got another pack here for Wulu. We'll put those there with him. And see what his second pack gets here. Let's see, we got a Great Ball, Lost Vacuum, Electric, Pancham, Shanks, Wulu. Helioptile, Scralp, Reverse Potion, and another Kyogre. All right. <laughs> so I guess Wulu, I mean, in my opinion, Wulu is winning because they both had Kyogre and Wulu is up a Stoutland. So, man, this does not want to go in this sleeve today. Hang on. There we go. Sorry about that. There we go. So we're up. We got a Kyogre and a Stoutland, so Wulu is currently up with a Stoutland. <laughs> Get into Charizard. Actually, you know what? I think Charizard's going to win, so we're going to jump over here to Hatina and see what Hatina gets and see if Charizard wins in the end. I think Charizard's going to win, but we will see. So this is Hatina's first pack. Got a ball toy and a Tangela and a Larvesta. Oh man, I guess I should have went right down. This is incredible. I should have just went right down the row because this would have been a fantastic one to end on. But there it is, Origin Form Palkia V Star. I I honestly think this is the same gold card we pulled before. I'm not sure though, but I think it is. You guys will have to let me know down in the comments. But man, one of the top cards in the set. Oh, of course, all of the gold cards are the top cards in the set for this one. Absolutely insane. Man, check that out. Wow. Well, uh, I don't know. I guess I guess it could be done. I guess Charizard could it could still be done, but I don't I don't know, man. I I think that's kinda I think that's kinda sealed the battle here. Uh, um there are a couple cards above Palkia, though, so uh, it's possible. I definitely don't expect it, but it's possible. <laughs> oh, let's see what else we get today, though. You know, I debated on whether or not to go down the line or whether to go, and like I said, I thought Charizard would win, so... Oh, and a Rotom V-Star. You know, the gold wasn't enough, so... Gold wasn't enough, so Hatina just wanted to pop a little V-Star on top of the gold card because that's what Hatina's wanted to do today, I guess. They just wanted to make sure, you know... Winning wasn't enough. He wanted to have a little extra on top. So we'll get into, uh, was it Yamper, I think? It's going to bug me if I don't double check. Yeah, Yamper. Get into Yamper's first pack here. You never know. These were out of two different cases. They were mixed and matched between two different cases of tins. So it's possible, you know, it's possible that we could have something else really good. You never know. But Yamper's first pack's gonna have reverse Croker Oak and a Zerain, uh, Zara Aura V Star. Very nice. That's what I mean. The the pull rate on this set is just absolutely insane. Cause even if you don't hit a glaring gallery, you can still hit a V or V Star or V Max even. And like some of the artworks on those are really good, you know, really good by themselves. And then the Glaring Gallery is just a huge bonus, in my opinion. So, this was an excellent set, and it's a great way to end the Sword and Shield era. Uh, getting ready for uh, uh, Violet and Scarlet, of course, as you guys know. 
And Yamper's second pack here, we're going to have... What are we going to have? Oh my god, guys. Mewtwo V-Star. I pulled one of these off camera. We're also going to have a Ditto. But uh, I pulled one of these off camera, and I was really kind of upset about it because this is just an absolutely beautiful card. And the texturing is amazing. And just an absolutely great card. You have Mewtwo and Charizard in the background. And you got, um, I think there was another one I saw in the background. Maybe it's just these two having a battle. But, oh no, there's a couple other Pokemon in the back there. This is just an absolutely beautiful, beautiful card. And uh, like I said, I was really kind of upset. I opened one off camera. And I was upset that I wasn't able to show share that with you guys. Let me, let me get that focus back in. There we go. I was really kind of upset that I wasn't able to get that. Like, I wasn't able to share that with you guys, but uh, here we are, man. That is absolutely incredible. We have two of the top cards out of these tins. I, that's just nuts. Uh, absolutely insane. Um, Like I said, we got that gold Palkia so far. That's what I mean, though. Like, like yes, that gold card's a big card, but with this set, it doesn't mean that it's a guaranteed win because... uh. The pull rate is just incredible. Absolutely insane. I never would have expected two of the top cards out of these. But uh, let's see what Charizard has in store. We got two packs in Charizard. And what Charizard gonna, Charizard's going to start with the Darkrai V-Star. Another absolutely insane card. Man. I, uh, I actually did a... I, Entered a uh, pack battle on PokeNest. Uh, if you don't know him on TikTok, check him out. But uh, I did a pack battle on there, and I actually was winning the pack battle until uh, another person pulled this card, and I so I lost to this card. But that's okay, because now I have one for my own set, which is actually kind of cool. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll tag PokeNest. Uh, I know he won't mind. Uh, I 100% support Pokenest. I get stuff from him quite a bit now that I, since I found him. And uh, the way he does his live streams and stuff, really, with his pricing, you can't lose. Like, if you get something on his live stream, you really can't lose. He does a great job. So, check him out. We got one more pack here from Charizard. Uh, I mean, it's going to take a gold or another Mewtwo or something. So, I don't think Charizard's going to win. But let me know who you guys thought won. That Mewtwo was absolutely insane. Uh, let me just double check that I got three cards. I think I'm going to do it this way. I think we're going to do the Glaring Gallery slot last, just to, just to switch it up a little, because we have the non-hollow Volcarona. And, uh, yeah, like I said, if you guys, like I was trying to say, we have these. Let me know which tin you thought won. Check out Pokenest, because I did mention him. And uh, for today, we're going to end on... A Calarian Gallery Cricketune. Very nice. That will fill another slot in my Cricketune. Uh, my Cricketune, or it'll fill another spot in my Glaring Gallery for sure. So that's two more spots in Glaring Gallery. So, I mean, obviously, like, you guys aren't going to agree with me because... Charizard really didn't win, but in my opinion, Charizard did win because it filled two spots in my glaring gallery. But let me know what you guys thought. I mean, we got we got that Kyogre V, we got the Stoutland V with a second Kyogre, which was kind of cool. And then, of course, we have that Cricketune glaring gallery, another beautiful card in in of all in the middle of all the Bunnelbees and some other stuff in there. Looks like that Darkrai V Star. This is an absolutely amazing card. The, the texturing on that is just incredible. It's another really, really nice card. And then we had we had that Zeraora V-Star. Very nice. And we had the Rotom V-Star. Another great card. And then, of course, the two massive hits. Palkia V-Star Origin Form, gold. And the Mewtwo V-Star, absolutely insane card this is by far my favorite card in this set i just yeah I, I don't know you just can't beat this card like in this particular set this card just can't be beat the artwork's insane uh and it's just it's just an amazing card so that's uh that's that's what i got for you for today that was absolutely insane um 
I hope you guys enjoyed this one. I, this was a ton of fun. You always, I mean, good openings like this are always a ton of fun. I mean, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We got nine hits out of 10 packs. That's insane. Um, but I just want to thank you for watching. Uh, if you made it this far, consider liking the video, maybe a subscribe to the channel so that you can get notified when I release more videos like these. And uh, we'll see you on the next one. Thanks for watching.